This demo shows how to map eDirectory users and their rights with the Active Directory users and their rights. User rights mapping involves two steps, creating a user map and mapping rights. Before we begin, there are a few prerequisites that we need to be aware of. Ensure that a password policy is assigned to the eDirectory admin user or an admin equivalent user. Ensure that universal password is set for the admin or admin equivalent user. Any eDirectory user can authenticate to NERM. eDirectory admin users or admin equivalent users with access rights on admin volume are authorized to use NERM. Any LDAP user can connect to Active Directory. Any user with browse rights to the container can query the Active Directory LDAP. You have the option of choosing to query based on common name, SAM account name, or any attribute. Choose your query based on the best match possible. Use this feature to match eDirectory users with the Active Directory user accounts. To create user maps, you need to connect to Active Directory. Enter the SAM account name, password and domain name. Click Connect. Click New. Verify the default options. Propose map to view the proposal. Match type users to user and LDAP attributes common name to SEM account name. Click Browse and select the eDirectory context. Click Browse and select the Active Directory context. Click View Map to view the proposed map. Verify the proposed map and click Save Map. Specify a name, then click Save. Use this feature to map rights to AD users on a specific NSS volume. Click Map Rights. Click New. Select a volume on which you want to map rights to Active Directory users. Select User Map as the source of user mapping. Select an appropriate user map name. Click Show. The user map is displayed along with the rights that will be assigned to the AD users. Select the Apply to Salvage, remove eDirectory trustees, and migrate IDE's options as needed. Click Apply. If you have NetIQ IDM for eDirectory to map Active Directory users in place, then you can select NetIQ IDM. NetIQ IDM creates some account in Active Directory based on the CN of users in eDirectory. NERM uses the DIR XML AD context attribute for framing the SEM account and getting the domain information. You can hide or display the user map and rights details using the show and hide buttons.
you can view exclusive rights of eDirectory and Active Directory users on files and directories in the specified volume. Click the rights, then select the volume. You can synchronize rights of the mapped eDirectory and Active Directory users, groups, and containers using the user rights map utility if you have modified the rights. You can either overwrite or merge rights. Open the user rights map utility. The mapped rights information is stored in a file and assigned an ID. You use this ID to synchronize the rights of the users. To find the ID, run the command as shown. To synchronize rights, run the command as shown. Refer to the main page for more details. This concludes the demonstration of mapping users, mapping rights, and synchronizing rights. Thank you for watching.